hello guys i want to share some technical information about mascam z which is nasa's mars op mission as you hear about it already on 24 feb the mascam z is the name of mast mounted camera that is equipped with a zoom function of the perseverance rover Mashcam has a cameras that can zoom in, focus and take 3D pictures and video at high speed to allow detailed examination of distant object. He is a Zimbel. He is a principal investigator, Arizona State University School of Earth and Space Exploration. This is a Mastcam Z. That's a dual camera. Its technical specific specs is uh, the main job is to take high definition video, panoramic color, and 3D images of the martial surface and features in the atmosphere with a zoom lens to magnify distance target. Its location is mounted on the rover mast at the eye level of 6.54 tall person that is 2 meter tall the camera are separated by 9.5 inches that is 24.2 centimeters to provide stereo vision its mass is approximately 8.5 pounds about 4 kilogram and its power used by 17.4 watts which is less about 100 watt bulb Volume is uh, camera head per unit that is 11 by 12 by 26 centimeter and digital electronics assembly 8.6 by 4.7 by 9 1.90 inches that is 22 by 12 by 5 centimeter calibration target is 3.9 by 3.9 by 2.7 inches that is 10 by 10 by 7 centimeters as if you hear about the data return then you will shock that is approximately 148 megabits per soul that is it's a average color quality similar to the consumer digital camera that is 2 megapixel only as you know 2 megapixel and image size is 1600 by 200 pixel maximum Image resolution about to resolve between about 150 micron per pixel that is 0 0.15 millimeter to 0 0.00059 inch to 7.5 millimeter that is 0 0.3 inches per pixel it's very great think about the Mastcam Z as the perseverance rover main size it is located near the top of the rover mast cam its head it's a camera system and it has a zoom capability z for the mark of zoom what you call it but it's a mad mast cam z she is elsa jensen malin space science system Elsa Jensen is uh, who leads uh, the uplink operation system operations team that sends uh, commands to Mastcam Z. As you see that uh, thousands of red color lines are here. These are the da data per second. That is thousands of per second data will be calculated and commands. Uh, these are thousands of commands in one time as you know is use a python language in it that's a great use of python language and he is a zartan kinch neil bohr institute of the university copenhagen <coughs> he led the design construction and testing of mast mast team mast Mastcam Z color calibration target which are used to tune the instrument setting 
he designed all the things that but the main target is to calibrate to the color ki matlab kaisa color hoga us mars par jaise red red so its a calibration target is more than the other things that's to clarify the image and how to zoom and all the things it's a rover it's have seven parts <coughs> science instrument are the state are the tools for acquiring information about martian geology atmosphere environmental condition and potential biosignatures that's a first we have to discuss the mascan z see mascan z is zambel principal investigator an advanced camera system with panoramic and stereotypic imaging capability with the ability to zoom the instrument also will determine min mineralogy of the martial surface and assist with rover operations okay it's a meta that is mars environmental dynamics analyzer a set of sensors that will provide measurement of temperature wind speed direction and pressure relative humidity dust size and shapes and it's and it's a moxi mars oxygen is isro experiment that is an exploration technology investigation that will provide of that will pro sorry that will produce oxygen from martial atmospheric carbon dioxide and this is a pixel you can see planetary instrument for x-ray lithochemistry an x-ray fluorescence spectrometer that will also certain an imager with a high resolution to determine the fine scale elemental composition of martial surface material pixel will provide capabilities that permit more detailed detection and analysis of chemical elements than ever before then we go forward yeah is a rimfax that is radar imager for mars sub surface experiment it's a, a ground penetrating radar that will provide centimeter scale resolution of the geologic structure of the sub sub surface and is a sherlock scanning habitual environment with raman and luminescence for organics and chemicals is a spectrometer that will provide uh, fine scale images uh, and uses an ultraviolet laser to determine fine scale minor mineralogy and detect organic compounds sherlock will be the first uv raman spectrometer to fly to the surface of mars and will provide supplementary measurements with other instruments in its the payload yeah it's a super cam an instrument that provide imaging chemical composition analysis and mineralogy the instrument will also able to detect the presence of organic compounds in rocks and regolith from a distance the instrument also has a significant contribution from the center national attitudes special institute that richard as renego that is france then we have to go to the forward yeah it's about the panoramic view the mascan z how to image creating that's first you know jaise aapne dekha hi hoga aapke phone mein panoramic view hota hai ki aap phone ko kisi bhi angle mein ghumate ho aur flip by flip wo image create karta chal jata hai वैसे ही ये फर्स्ट उस 
फर्स्ट आउटर सर्कल क्रिएट करता है देन सेकेंड आउटर सर्कल देन थर्ड आउटर सर्कल एंड देन फोर्थ एंड देन ऐसे करते करते मतलब पूरा ही क्रिएट करता चल जाता है इससे पेनॉर्मिक व्यू एंड सी ये अपने ही रोवर की इमेज भी निकाल रहा है नाउ वी हैव टू गो फॉरवर्ड या दिस इज अ रोवर विच इज डिजाइन बाय हिम He's very intelligent person. He's create a target about uh, how to manage the color on Mars. NASA Mars 2020 Perseverance rover goes first high resolution tour around its new home in Jezero crater in 21 Feb. After rotating its mast or head 360 degree, allowing the rover. Mask Z instrument to capture its first panorama after touching down on the red planet on February 18. It was a rover's second panorama ever. The rover navigation cameras or nav cams also located on the mask captured a 360 degree view on Feb 20. Mask Z is a dual camera system equipped with a zoom function allowing the camera to zoom in focus and take high definition video as well as the panoramic panoramic view color and 3d images of the march martian surface with this capability the robotic astrobiologist can provide a detailed examination of the both close and distant object and this camera will help scientists such as the geologic history and atmospheric condition of jezora crater and will assist in identify rocks and sediment worthy of a closer look by the rover other instruments the cameras also will help the mission team determine which rocks the rover should sample and collect to form eventual return for earth in the future is teacher together from 142 images the newly released panorama reveals the crater rim and cliff face of the ancient river delta in the distance the camera system can reveal details as small as 0.21 to 0.2 inches that is 3 to 5 mm across near that rover and 6.5 to 10 feet that is 2 to 3 m across the distance slopes along the horizon the detail composite images show a martial martian surface that to appear similar to images captured by previous nasa rover missions this is a two world war beginning is on a rover these are the images that the rover on create mac mz to zoom in and zoom out there's a zoom in view and is also a zoom in view by mascam z he says we are next to try it in a sweet spot where you can see different features similar in many ways to feature found by spirit to opportunity and curiosity at their landing site asu leads the operation of mascam z instrument working in collaboration with Malin Space Science System in San Diego and Mascam Z Mascam Z design is an evolution of NASA's Curiosity Mars rover's Mascam instrument which has two camera of fixed focal length rather than zoomable cameras the two cameras on perseverance mesh cam z dual camera are mounted on the rover mast at eye level of the person 6 feet 6 inches 2 meters tall they sit 9.5 inches that is 20.24.1 cm apart to the provide stereo vision 
and can produce color images with a quality similar to that of a consumer digital digital camera hd camera the mascam z team includes dozens of scientists engineers operations specialists managers and students from a variety of institution in addition the team includes deputy principal and investigator justin mackey of nasa's jet propulsion laboratory in south california i want to share some key objectives of the perseverance mission mission on mars astrobiology including the search for sign of ancient microbial life the rover will characterize the planet geology and past climate pave the way for human exploration of the red planet and be the first mission to cal- collect and cache martian rock and b- that is broken rock and dust subsequent nasa mission in cooperation with esa that is the european space agency would send the space craft to, to mars to collect these sealed samples from the surface and return them to earth from for in depth analysis the mars 2020 perseverance mission is a part of nasa's moon to mars exploration approach which includes artemis mission to moon that will help prepare for human exploration of the red planet jpl which is managed by nasa's nasa's by calcat caltech in pasadena california built and manages the operation over the perseverance rover i want to share some video see how to zoom in and zoom out by nascam z see how clear this image is only 2 megapixel camera but it have a speed of 146 mbps is very high that is image size 1600 to 200 pixel maximum but data returns 148 megabits per sol average and color quality you see the camera image resolution is 0.3 inches per pixel or you can say 150 micron per pixel to 7.5 mm per pixel thank you